What's going on gamers? It's me, Daily Tactics here, and today we are going to be getting into another LEGO Star Wars video. So if you enjoy these videos on my channel, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. We're going to be doing a big LEGO giveaway at 200k, uh, and comment down below what kind of LEGO videos you would like to see in the future. But uh, in today's video, I have a little something I need to show you guys. This whole... Lego table situation guys, it, it, it's getting to be a bit much. It, it's a disaster here and m my inner anxiety is like I, I just I need to clean this. <laughs> it's driving me up a wall. Um, so what I did was I actually ordered one of these, a little um, part sorter. This is actually for um, like power tools and drill bits and nails and and whatnot, screws, you know, you know the works. Uh, but I think it will work pretty pretty well for Legos. There's like separators in the interior and things like that. I think this thing uh, will definitely come in handy, but I thought it was going to be a lot bigger and be able to house all of my Lego minifigures. Um, but I realized that's not the case. So what I think I'm going to put into here is all of our Lego clone troopers. So this is going to start housing the Lego clone trooper army. And I thought it would be really, really cool to do a time lapse of me sorting through all of the Lego clone troopers and putting them into this thing. Um, just the sheer mass of clone troopers will look uh, pretty cool to sort through uh, and also it might give you guys some ideas on uh, how you might want to try sorting through your uh, Lego Star Wars collection. I don't know. Um, I'm still sort of working on how I'm going to plan this but I'm thinking like shinies go in here, phase 2 troopers, 501st, I, I don't know. I, I still got to sort of work things through in my head but um, I think it'll be a cool fun little project for a video so uh, let's get into it boys. Alright guys, I thought this would be interesting to show. This is just all of the clone troopers in a pile right now that were on the table. There are a few, I think, still in the bucket and stuff over there, uh, and some need to be washed over there as well, so uh, those will need to be accounted for a little bit later, but um, yeah, this is, this is all that was on the table, which is insane. This is all Clone Wars clone trooper stuff, except for maybe this guy. I think he's Old Republic. To be completely honest, I'm I'm decently sure he is Old Republic, so maybe he goes out of the pile. But uh, yeah, some of it is destroyed, some of it is pristine and brand new. It's just interesting to have it all here in a pile, and I'm gonna start sorting it into that bucket. So should be pretty cool. Um, I will report back in when that is accomplished. I just think it's really fun to look at all of this just in a pile. It's kind of cool. All right, boys, here we go. The clone army is finally in order. <laughs> Thank goodness. I do still have some work to do because there are some miscellaneous clones I'm missing and stuff like that. Like, I couldn't find my Commander Fox. I couldn't find a few uh, 
fan gifts, and I think they might just be in the um, minifigure bucket that Total Tank Simulator sent me. So uh, I, I'm going to need to re-go through that and, and find those. However, we do have these. So here's how it's ordered. Bottom drawer, all Phase 1 Clone Troopers. Both the Clone Wars variant as well as... Uh, yeah, here we go. Here's one. Uh, the um, movie variant from Attack of the Clones. Uh, so that's just drawer number one. Drawer number two. Second Airborne and 212th in the back, uh, as well as Clyde from my stop motion. Uh, and then in the front, we have the 501st, as well as the 332nd. Basically just um, Captain Rex's boys. That, that's who's in uh, there. All right, above that, we have um, the 41st Elite Corps slash Green Troopers that weren't lieutenants, basically, or sergeants or whatever they are. Uh, just just soldiers colored green um, who I didn't really have another place for um, and didn't belong in the officers category because I do have an officers category. Uh, and then behind them, I have Wolfpack Troopers, both Commander Wolf, Phase 1 and Phase 2 Troopers are in there as well as a couple Customs. Then over here, we have the uh, Battle of Geonosis troopers right there, uh, and behind them we have some Bomb Squad troopers. I thought I had more Bomb Squad troopers. Actually, I know I had more Bomb Squad troopers, because I bought like 10, and then I had some more too, so I don't know where my troopers are to be completely honest. Like, I genuinely, I've lost a few. I think I need to go through all my buckets and stuff, because I, I actually don't know where some troopers are. Uh, but either way, continuing with the drawers. This drawer has basically red troopers slash 91st reconnaissance. I don't know, I started categorizing by colors after I didn't have enough of each legion. I hope you guys understand where I'm coming from there. Uh, then on top of that, I had any officers in that one, and then uh, special troopers like gunners or pilots in the back one there. Uh, over here, I had 327th Troopers, uh, and then behind that, I had just miscellaneous. Those guys just, I couldn't figure out a place to put them, really, or they wouldn't fit in their designated places, so miscellaneous. Uh, above that, we have Captain Locke's uh, Horn Company soldiers right there. I love Horn Company. They are epic. Uh, then over here, we have miscellaneous heads as well as jetpacks. And I know I have a ton more of these, and I'm going to have to sort those out and, and find them. Um, above that, I have miscellaneous custom weapons. Uh, and to the left of that, I have DC-15 A's. And then, no, no DC-15 A's in the back, DC-15 C's in the front have a whole lot of those. I didn't realize how many I had, but that's awesome. Um, and then below that, I have uh, painted troopers from when I was young, and those don't really fit any category. Uh, so yeah, I mean, that's what we've got going right now uh, for the Clone Trooper Army. Um, there's, there is room for expansion in here, which I'm, I am glad about, and I, I will probably end up shifting things around. Um, something I really need to do is... Uh, find where those missing clones are because that's actually kind of worrisome like the commander fox clone he's worth a lot of money and i i don't want to just like lose him so i i really hope i have him around i do have a spare commander fox um torso as well as helmet but i don't have the full figure and i know for a fact i have the full figure because he was in that all clone trooper commanders episode uh that i did uh probably a month or two ago, so I, I genuinely don't know where he is, and I hope to find him. Uh, one thing I didn't include in here was, like, the um, old clones, the old clone troopers. I, I probably will end up putting them in the Rebel one of these, or I, I don't remember if I mentioned this, but I have a bigger one on the way of this, and it's got, like, six of these drawers, and then, like, 20 of those drawers, or something like that. Like, it's proportionally a lot bigger. Um... And so uh, I'll probably put like every other minifigure I have in that one and sort it probably by like Rebels, Imperials, stuff like that, blah, blah, blah. Um, and I'll probably put the old versions of the Clone Troopers in probably the Rebel section of that or something along those lines. I mean, I still have, I mean, just Troopers scattered everywhere. And then I also have uh, this whole thing, which is filled with 
just everything under the sun that isn't clones, except there might be a few clones in here. I genuinely don't know, so I gotta figure that out. Oh, there's a moth. Ugh, get out of here, moth. Gross. Ah, I need, yeah, I need to search through everything and, and just find all of my Lego minifigures so we can finally get this place a little bit cleaned up. I am happy with what we've done today. We, we definitely did clean up a lot of it, which is nice, mainly over here. Over here needs some work. I want a pl place to put all of our weapons. That would be so nice, but, you know, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, bit of a different one. I hope it was still interesting for you guys, but uh, it's something I needed to do, and I thought, hey, it might be a little bit entertaining for you guys. So I do hope you enjoyed. Either way, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Comment down below what you think of it, what your favorite part of this video was. Subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to hit that like button. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.